The classic sitcom That 70s Show aired from 1998 to 2006 and featured an iconic cast of actors and actresses. Fast forward to 2023 and the follow-up series That 90s Show is finally out. We see their characters all grown up and now it's time to catch up with the stars who made us laugh for so many years, Topher Grace, Laura Preppen, Mila Kunis, Ashton Kutcher, and the rest of the gang. We have all the scoop on their real age, life partners, and what they've been up to since they left the beloved series. Topher Grace as Eric Topher Grace is an American actor who's had a successful career in television and film. His full name is Christopher John Grace. He's 44 years old and his birthday is on July 12, 1978. He was born in New York City. His zodiac sign is Cancer, so he's familiar with all the sign's most beloved traits like loyalty and creativity. The actor has spent the last two decades making fans laugh with his memorable roles. One of Topher's most iconic performances was as Eric Foreman on That 70s Show from 1998 to 2006, and we're so thrilled to have him back in the follow-up series, That 90s Show. This time, the show focuses on Eric and Donna's daughter, Leia Foreman, and it takes place in the 90s. Since then, he's been in a handful of other TV shows and movies. He's featured in films such as Spider-Man 3, Valentine's Day, Predators, and Black Klansmen. More recently, he starred in the comedy series Home Economics. Eric got his happy ever after with Donna, and in real life, Topher also got his happy ever after. He started dating actress Ashley Henshaw in 2014, and the couple later got married in 2016. They now have two kids together, a daughter and a son. In September 2022, he announced that they're expecting their third child. Laura Preppen as Donna Laura Preppen has had an extremely successful career in television and film. She's 42 years old and her birthday is on March 7, 1980. She was born in Wachung, New Jersey. Her zodiac sign is Pisces. The majority of her fame comes from her role as Donna Pinciotti on the hit comedy sitcom That 70s Show, which first premiered in 1998. She reprises her role as Donna in That 90s Show, and her performance was as perfect and as hilarious as ever. Since then, she's gone on to appear in several shows and movies like October Road, How I Met Your Mother, Are You There Chelsea, and The Girl on the Train. Her most recent project is her role as Alex Voss in Netflix's Orange is the New Black. In the past, she was in a relationship with Christopher Masterson from 1999 to 2007. Then she went on to date Scott Michael Foster before breaking up in 2013. In addition to her incredible acting career, she also found love. In 2018, she married actor Ben Foster. The couple now have two children together, a daughter and a son. Laura's Instagram is filled with the most adorable photos and videos with their husband and kids, and fans couldn't be any happier for her. Mila Kunis as Jackie Mila Kunis is one of the most celebrated stars in Hollywood. She's 39 years old and her birthday is on August 14, 1983. She was born in Chernivsky, Ukraine. Her zodiac sign is Leo. Her career started at a young age when she moved to the United States with her family and landed a role on That 90s Show as Jackie Burkhart. Since then, Mila has starred in various movies such as Forgetting Sarah Marshall, Black Swan, Friends with Benefits, Ted, Bad Moms, to name a few. And of course, she continues to be the voice actor for Meg Griffin and Family Guy. It's not surprising that so many people admire Mila because she continues to give us amazing content throughout the years. We can't wait to see what else this talented star has in store for us. She was in a long-term relationship with Home Alone actor Macaulay Culkin from 2002 to 2011. After that, she reunited with her That 70s Show co-star and love interest Ashton Kutcher and they hit it off. 
They didn't have romantic chemistry in that 70s show because of their age difference, with Mila being 14 and Ashton being 19. But it really is a story of true love because they found their way to each other. And to make their love story even cuter, Ashton Kutcher was Mila Kunis' first kiss. The two got married in 2015 and they have two kids together, Wyatt Isabel born in 2014 and Dimitri Portwood born in 2016. Ashton Kutcher is Michael. Ashton Kutcher is a name that just everyone knows about. He's 45 years old and his birthday is on February 7, 1978. He was born in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. His zodiac sign is Aquarius and he's been making us laugh for over 20 years. Apart from being an actor, he's also a producer, investor, and philanthropist. His breakout role came in in 1998 when he starred as Michael Kelso in the hit sitcom That 70s Show. Since then, he's had roles in numerous movies, such as Dude Where's My Car, Just Married, The Butterfly Effect, Killers, and No Strings Attached, just to name a few. And of course, he's also most known for hosting the show Punk. Recently, he's been seen as Colt Bennett in the Netflix series The Ranch, which premiered in 2016. It was so heartwarming seeing Michael Kelso with his and Jackie's son Jay in that 90s show. Before his marriage to Mila Kunis, he was married to actress Demi Moore from 2005 to 2013, who's 15 years older than him. He married Demi after her divorce with Bruce Willis. In fact, she wrote about their marriage in her memoir. He also dated Brittany Murphy in 2012 after they worked together in Just Married. Wilmer Valderrama as Fez Wilmer Valderrama is an exciting and well-known actor, producer, and host. He's 43 years old, and his birthday is on January 30th, 1980. He was born in Miami, Florida. His zodiac sign is Aquarius, so it's safe to say he's a creative soul with a passion for the entertainment industry. He's an Aquarius just like Ashton Kutcher, which explains their close friendship. He's best known for his role as Fez on the hit series That 70s Show. But he's had quite the impressive career, having starred in several shows like NCIS, Naval Criminal Investigative Service, From Dust Till Dawn the Series, and Minority Report. As if that weren't enough, he even ventured into producing, hosting, and he's the voice actor for Augustine and Encanto, and Manny and Handy Manny. He's dated several celebrities in the past, like Mandy Moore, Lindsay Lohan, and Demi Lovato. He's now engaged to Amanda Pacheco, who's 11 years younger than him. They had their child together in February 2021, a daughter. Thanks for watching! Comment who your favorite character from That 70s Show is. And don't forget to like and subscribe!